How y'all doing? It's Monday, baby. Monday. It's not so hot down here in South Texas today. A little front move through, and we're glad to have it. Anyway, I hope you're having a great day. Anyway, we, we made it through the weekend without a shutdown, baby. How about that shit? Came mighty close, so they was all wanting it over there on the uh, Republican side, at the, the extreme right over there. Uh, Matt Gates and Bo Barton, all that group over there, they wanted to shut it down, baby. But they, they got a 45-day uh, a CR out of it, so we're going to continue the, the government for another 45 days, and we'll see what happens. Boy, howdy shit. Uh, Kevin McCarthy is still speaker, as as I know right now. Uh, Matt Gates came out there today talking about, yada, 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 we're going to can't do this, and the American people this, that, and the other. A bunch of bullshit that the hard right, the Freedom Caucus, uh, want to hold their breath and scream over there until they get their way, and I don't really give a shit. We got a continuing resolution to keep the government open, then we'll go back to the drawing board and let's see what we can get the Republicans to do. But that's not the news, baby. Today, the news is Donnie. What's up with Donnie? Donnie's in court in New York City, baby. That's right. Uh, he's up there uh, in the fraud trial. Uh, now, mind you, the judge has already found him liable for fraud uh, outright because it's pretty much obvious what he was doing. But uh, Donnie Boy wanted to show up in court. Now, he did not have to show up in court today. He could have just let this go on by, but no, Donnie is not going to let this go. Are you shitting me? This is a campaign rally, baby. That's what this is, and he's taking full advantage of it. He's already been out there talking about Letitia James being a racist, and this is all a witch hunt, and the judge, the uh, judge, what is his name? And, and Goron, Judge and Goron, he's a he's a disgrace. He's uh he's uh should be criminally charged. Uh, he's uh, uh election interference. He's uh uh a Democratic operative. Ah, no shit, he Democratic. Op well, he's doing a damn good fine job then. Anyway, he's using this as exactly that a campaign rally. Every time he gets a break, he's going to be out there in front of the news cameras, spouting his mouth about how he is the greatest person in the world that all his properties are worth billions of dollars because of his brand. And he compared himself to Coca-Cola. You bet your ass, Donald Trump and Coca-Cola mean the same thing. It is what the what the what the uh, brand says it is. If if Coke wants to charge fifty dollars a can, they can do that. Would they sell any? No. W would everybody look at them like they've lost their freaking mind? Yeah, they would. But Donnie Boy, Donnie Boy thinks all his properties are worth billions and billions and billions of dollars because they're owned by him. Well, then you should be paying taxes on them billions and billions and billions of dollars. But that's not what you did. You lied on the forms. You lied any way you could. As typical from Donnie, that's all you've ever gotten out of the man is a bunch of bullshit about his Trump wine, his Trump university, his Trump steaks, his Trump water. I don't care what it was, bullshit he was trying to sell. He lathers it on like it is the best in the world. Baby. You know, it, it, it would be comical if it wasn't so damn dangerous. But this is the, this is the world we live in nowadays, and this is what it's going to be like from now until the next election is a continuing saga of Donnie and his crying little ass up there talking about how he's been persecuted and next thing you know, we're gonna wanna nail him to a cross. Ah, ah, not a bad idea. Anyway, I just think that uh, we need to kick back and relax and watch this for what it is, a clown show, entertainment for the masses, that's all it is. The news is gonna eat it up and that's his, that's his, uh, his whole point there, his whole his whole reason for doing this was to eat up the news with as much news about Donnie that you can get. Remember, Donnie always said, good news, bad news, it doesn't matter as long as you're in the news. Well, Donnie's in the news every freaking day, and I think we're just all about sick of it. Anyway, it is Monday, so enjoy your day. We'll be back live tomorrow night for another Blue Dot Family Meeting. Uh, enjoy the entertainment. Donnie will be coming out, I'm sure, right after the trial today, demanding this and shaking fingers at that and doing this kind of shit. I don't know. But whatever it is, uh, get a laugh out of it because that's all it's worth. Anyway, we'll see y'all later. Take care.